of the United States of America. Requiring kids to recite the Pledge of Allegiance in Arizona schools. It's the latest bill moving through the state legislature. We stand and say the Pledge of Allegiance every day on this floor. What's good for us is good for the children. Republican Representative Barbara Parker is sponsoring the bill. It would require public and charter schools to set aside a time every day for the pledge. Students could only opt out if they are 18 years old or get a note from a parent. Parents have a right to, um, uh, to direct the education of their child, and this is a parent right state. This bill is plainly unconstitutional. Marilyn Rodriguez is a lobbyist with Creosote Partners. She says kids are protected and this bill violates their rights. I think it's important to remember that the speech rights of a student versus their parents are distinct. The court has long held this um, and it's just very important to remember that those constitutional rights are sacred. In 1943, the Supreme Court ruled that compelling kids to say the Pledge of Allegiance is unconstitutional. Rodriguez says if signed into law, this bill would only lead to lawsuits. We have well-established case law that demonstrates demonstrates a, a long-held precedent here that this bill flies in the face of, um, and it would uh, very likely attract lawsuits um, related to the First Amendment uh, speech rights uh, of students. Now, the bill uh, passed the House and Senate Education Committee. It is now moving on to a full vote in the Senate. Live in the newsroom, Emma Lockhart for Arizona's Family.